Yeah, just obviously crazy excited to be here uh, in Detroit playing for the MAC Championship game. Obviously crazy proud of my team. Uh, the players uh, fought through a lot this year. Coach, how special is it for you to be able to be here after taking over this program, the state was, it was at, and you know, finally get to the MAC Championship game? I'm going to introduce the 36th head coach in the history of Miami football, Jeff Martin. We're going to win some football games, and, and, and Miami football tradition is coming back. Chuck Martin came over from Notre Dame and knew that the struggles here were going to go away quickly. But a win today, if this game holds up, would be mammoth for a program that went through the entire 2013 season without a win. Yeah, no, it's awesome. Uh, anytime you get to play a conference championship game, it's awesome. But obviously, if you take over a program, that was 0-16. And, and then just seeing the, the process and, and the growth of our team and for these kids to know for the rest of their lives that they were they were part of, you know, turning the bleakest years in Miami football around and getting it back uh, to have an opportunity to play in, in the MAC championship is something that they, I'm sure they'll take with them the rest of their lives. We've been in a bunch of hard games, a lot of uh, big spotlight games, you know, we take we see this as just one another one of those games and I feel as if we were to put too much pressure on it then we wouldn't be able to perform like we know we're capable of. And the Miami Red Hawks have come into Peden Stadium to now be in the driver's seat in the MAC East. What a performance by Miami. We come to you from Ford Field in Detroit, home of the NFL's Lions. The Miami Red Hawks, the winningest team in the history of the Mid-American Conference champions in the East Division, will take on Central Michigan. Race was hard. Race was hard. Every snap today is going to be hard. It's going to be hard to stay focused. You're at Ford Field. There's going to be a lot of people screaming shirt. It's going to be noisy. It's going to be rough. Miami will receive to get this MAC championship game started. Maurice Thomas, an all-conference return man, has the 30 across midfield, gets a block, cuts it back. He's got a chance to make a house call, and Thomas all the way down inside the five, down at the two. And this time, Bester is into the end zone for a touchdown. What a start for Miami. This is exactly what they needed. Complimentary football, that's how Miami's going to win the game. They do it on a three and out by their defense. That should shorten the field for their offense. Off play action. And engulfed. Butler and Costin. Lazaro will keep it. He's got room, and he's in for a score. Ties the game at seven. Close to midfield, it's a fake. Miami all over it. Special teams again. Special teams coming up big for Miami. Automatic. You get instant field position and Miami takes advantage. They get three points. Looking for six. Touchdown. All the momentum right now is with Central Michigan. starts. Sloman 13 out of 14 from inside 40. Make it 14 out of 15 and Miami's lead is six. Quentin Dormady on the crossing route. It's Jonathan Ward, a slippery running back. Lazaro will throw, looking for Colton, makes the catch! So now you've got momentum after two plays on offense. Dormady steps up, 
Downfield, intercepted! Picked off by Travion Banks! championship to be possible. Uh, character of kids, character of coaches. My kids love each other, play for each other. Help oh, deal. What are the emotions right now? I'm just crazy proud of everybody in that organization. So. Pretty nice job for a second team all-league kicker. Yeah. <laughs>